Can I have your attention? Get down! Fill up! Fill up! Fill up! Now! Fill up! Now! Take out your mobile phones and slam them towards me! Right now! Bring it up! Bring it up! Ladies and gentlemen, our plan is to hurt no one, so remain calm and nobody dies. You! E? Your head, right? Yes! The monitor! Yes! Move it! Open the vault! Move it! Move up! Open the vault! Listen, check it. Four crooks and the rookie. So when the pressure come, the fifth crumble like the cookie. And undercover cops coming through trying to book me. I knew there was something wrong when this man shook me. Huh, it don't move me. It's all about the Benjamins. Getting chased down the freeway, but I'm still smoking in the Benjamin. Trying to get my money right. So if you play with my money, then it turns to a bloody fight. But all day and all night, we all right. right. With the looks of a killer, the mob type. All black with the Timberland boots. 21 gun salute for the troops, we just shoot There's no limit to the steps we take We make fools out of dudes who investigate So let me set this straight, we won't hesitate Till we're rich and we're walking through heaven's gate Listen, four crooks and the rookie and the rookie. Double six, it just sit back and check it Look, I pay the cost to be the boss I smack a nigga up and stick him up for his boss The bank is right around the corner, okay? Okay. Hope you're not tired of walking. Nope. Nope. Who says that? Laolu. Laolu. Oh, the cute little boy in your class. Your mom told me you have a crush on him. No. Oh, come on. You can tell me. I'm your favorite aunt, remember? I don't have a crush on him. Okay. But you like him. <laughs> uh huh. So do you think he knows? I don't know. Oh, come on. I can understand. Hey! Oh boy, see wastes. Oh boy, see legs. This one a winning team. The girl said die. Be like now this one I go marry. Check out the Manchester from side. Chai! This night in the call. Chai! Full complete squad. Oh boy. Chai! I beg, I beg. Do not just wait. I don't know where they go now. As in, is this kind of girl just grief for me? Eh? <laughs> well, light I don't marry like yesterday. This occult bank security does. Basically, they're meant to detect all metal objects hidden in 
handbags, pockets, or wherever. Would you like to try it out? This kind of girl could make you begin speaking tongues. Labros, Kebesi, Westeresi, Lake Sepa. Oh boy! Okay, now who I don't know where she enter. What do you want to do? No, be just, babe. She did bite. We just to enter, they say, my name is so so so. I like you. But I know if you talk plenty because I did on duty. So give me your number, make I call you later. It never finish. You say, Tonya, you own now your mouth. Mouth, <laughs> just it. Look that big. You look that big. Look. You know, say no easy now. No easy. The blue way. No easy now. Wait, oh. What is no easy? Hi! Una they fail. As in, eh? Una they slack. Pieces. Please go back in the bus of the metal 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 I want to help you. Tony, you know what's in it? You help us go meet her as woman to woman, full and top. She knows if you embarrass you, do you can embarrass us now? Just help us full and top. That's man. She knows if you embarrass you. Why are you the laugh? And if you decide, Miss Yan, people don't go understand what's up. They go take and say that the normal tension between me. They talk this girl, they laugh. Why? It's not. Once one guy go there now, she can't holler. People go understand how far now. They go not say they try to stand and they get no grip. <laughs> now laugh with the issue now. Ah, Tonya. I don't know. Why are you there? Come on, come on, come on. Now I know you. Hello, pretty lady. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? Whoa, that's a smart girl. I'm fine, thank you too. What's your name and how old are you? My name is Amy and I'm six years old. And it's my first time in a bank. Oh, really? <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. You're welcome. Gosh, she's a smart girl. Everyone says that. Is she your daughter? No, she's my niece. She's on holiday and I'm on leave. I'm just taking her out. <laughs> <laughs> so how much you wanna go pay me? Any amount. Any amount. Tonya, open mouth. Any amount you want for me, you. I give you. Shake now. Any. I go make a no one thing first. Out of the twelve, una. Why they go toast the girl? Nami, Baba, Nami, na. Come over there. See, worry, Tonya. Nami, what did they do? See, talk to one for me. Tell her see. Me, they gonna get prospects of becoming Inspector General. Inspector, chance. Come over there. See, see, Tonya. Once that babe sights me. Hey, da, da. On a fine boy, no pimples left. <laughs> you know how far now. You know how far. <laughs> Wait, so I beg, I beg, I beg. This girl, nah, she don't know whether the two of them are there exist. I don't know how big on herself for this motor. See me first. I beg. Uh -huh. See what we're going to do. We go wait. May she come out. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Then when she come out, eh, I will come go follow and talk. Then I will come bring and come here. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. And the person will get the best yarn in school, carry the girl. Shake it now. Agree for that As one. As in deal. For I me, agree for, for that me. one. What do you do? For me, not deal. See. As in deal. <laughs> agree for that one. <laughs> Hi. Um, I am Dekunle. If you resemble family. Dekunle, you say? Why not the laugh? He said what? Why you the laugh? He said what? Why you the laugh? Inspire you, you can smell for. Not to confirm you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Baby, yeah. can we go to have lunch? Share our time. Oh, oh that's you. Salary, I'll finish. On top of salary, they could have. No sudden movement.
Move it, move it, move it! <laughs> open the vault! Ah! <laughs> it takes the keys to open the vault. And who has the second key? Ah! The, the head of operations, Toba. Toba! <laughs> He's the guy who works. Go and get the keys here now! It's in the drop. the printed those 5,000 Naira bills. Would have been so easy to steal. Hurry up! Wow. How much can I bank with this now? <laughs> one customer. One customer. Since. Now the same question why I won't ask before. She don't did the pass uh, 30 minutes now. Now here we go sleep. You know what? Mo will leave this team or go back to work. No. What do you mean by no? So, if she didn't work here, now here we we'll go there till the bank go close. Don't be part of here. Come, then, let me see. Ah, here. Now, through uh, uh, Tony Adiano. I go many times with her here, they waste now, say, say with the way for babe. Yes, so. If you know, say you don't go feel go inside, go follow her talk. Mo will go back to work. See, oh. see. Tony, no be the girl issue now. Ah, yeah. No be about the girl, now about who? Who the issue can't they about? You know, I don't know to say something they strange about this bank. Like waiting. They do the talk, no come on for you. We don't waste time for here. I know this since we come this bank. Everybody we don't enter never come out. And even those with the inside this bank since before we come, they never show outside. Though. You know, I know the reason we tell the reason so. Be now only me. Me now is this. I stop. That's enough. What? We already got enough. We have to leave now. Enough. But there's still money left in the safe now. Yeah. And we've been in here longer than we planned. Well, that's because there's more money in the safe than we planned for. Uh, well, yeah, now we might as well take it all. I will not the run, Bele. No, come on, guys. We've always stuck to the rules. Let's not get greedy this time. Boss, chill out. This could be our manna from heaven. Well, if you guys ask me, I would say we leave now while we still have the chance. I mean, I'm having a really bad feeling about this. Oh, shut up, you rookie. What do you know? I, I, okay. 60 seconds more and that's it. Cool. Pack my money, bitch. That's right. Maybe they are workers now this time. You know, slow motion, pensioner style. Nah, lie. Ah. I didn't keep my money with this bank. I know that style. Yeah. I feel like something they happen now. Uh, I didn't think so. Maybe they assist them this slow. Or oh, they down. No, no. Then why people will not see money put or come out? No go, come back later. Oh no, no, try now. What is going to happen with that now? It makes sense, it makes sense, it makes sense. Because see, Ninja people, <laughs> no time, oh. They need to come to sit down, look off. Oh. If I don't come out, things, cost you on top. And then money now. <laughs> it makes sense. Eh, but they could what do you think the thing where you suspect? Stay down! Shit! 
watered. Police. Police? You must see what I talk about. Person just people. No, 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 no. From inside that bank. You? You know she am? Not true. Not true. Not true. But... What do you suggest me could do now? You go check her mom now. Huh? 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 No, that one will be foolishness. He better make a call for reinforcement. He better. Better. Who called the police? I swear. Who called the police? I, swear, I don't know. I, I don't know. You better start talking before I paste your brain all over these walls. I swear, I don't know. Where is the panic button? There's no panic button in this branch. No panic button in this branch. You, you, you guys still could have found some way. No one could have called the police. I swear my life. No one could have called the cops. I don't think we got all the facts. Should we search everybody? Spend our time figuring out how to get out of here. You need to do the come. I'm on a day. So be turned and they with them. Should they follow them come? What do we do now? Can't can't we go to the back door? Where's the back door? There is no back door. What do you mean there's no back door? Every building has what I want exit. We sealed off the other door with concrete to prevent soup from the generator permitting the back door. You see, I, I told you guys, let's go, let's go, but you wouldn't let's Shut go. up! What's wrong with you, man? Put yourself together. Oh, I told you, shut up, bro. Just look at Shut up! <laughs> now listen up! The presence of a police vehicle outside these walls must have raised some ideas in some of you. But let me assure you, we will take this money and we will walk. So you're left with two options. You keep your cool and live. Or make it a sound and ensure a bloodbath. It's up to you. Guys, let's move. You see to traffic. I don't want no cars coming this way. You get me a loudspeaker. Does anybody know if there's a cyber cafe around here? Yes, ma'am. There is one on the next street. Okay, go there. Get the bank online and see if you can get any of the phone numbers within the banking hall. Ma'am, I can do it with my phone. Okay, quick, quick, quick. Now type in Nexus Bank forward slash Marina Branch. It's all, guys. Silly. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm not pleased to inform you that your predicaments have taken a new twist. What you're now experiencing is no longer a robbery. I hereby pronounce you hostages. Now listen up! We need five hostages to use as window curtains. Well, just in case any police sniper starts getting funny ideas, those five hostages We'll take the hit. Now, any volunteers? No, 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 Loon. I mean, we're gonna be here with these guys for a while. I think we should treat them better, you know? Let's have some fun with them, yeah? You guys now, make yourself comfortable. I mean, take, have a seat. Good, good, good. Anybody want anything? Coffee? Tea? Me? 
<laughs> I've always wanted to use that one. <laughs> along with you. Move the seats. Move it that way. That way. Move it that way. Hello? Yeah, I'm superintendent. I'm not interested in knowing whom you are. Now listen and listen tight. I've got no fewer than 20 civilians in here. And I must say that I'm not a professional in this game of hostage taking. But one thing I know how to do professionally is kill. And that I intend to do twice per hour until either you meet my demands or I run out of bargaining options. So the choice is yours. And what are your demands, sir? My men and I need a fully fueled helicopter and a pilot waiting for us outside. No police escorts and no snipers. If you waste my time, somebody dies. If you try any stunts, somebody dies. The choice is yours. <laughs> somebody shut that kid up right now! Sorry, it's just that she needs to use the bathroom. Nobody leaves this fucking hole! Please, her tummy really aches. I said nobody leaves this hole! But the toilet is just out the corridor. Did I ask you a question? Are you talking to me? I was just saying that there's a ah! You don't speak ah! when you spoke with you! Do you understand me? Help me! Help me! Help me! I'm so embarrassed! No! Help me! You're gonna kill him, man! Please. What do you think I wanna do? What the hell is wrong with you? Get out of the way! No! Hurting anyone is not part of the plan! Get out of the fucking no! way! Stop! It is not part of the That's plan! That's enough! Stop! That's enough! What? This Leave guy. the man alone. <laughs> I said stop. <laughs> Take the girl to the bathroom. Take her to the bathroom. <laughs> no. Nobody goes anywhere on a If you want to be Santa Claus, be Santa Claus. And take her to the bathroom and wait there until they're finished. <laughs> Let's go. Ma, I didn't get the loudspeaker you asked for. But I was able to get this DJ to allow us to use the equipment as a public address system. So you're a DJ? Yes, yes I. DJ Topedo, number one dancehall DJ in town. And where are your equipment? My state-of-art equipment? Packed outside, ma'am. Have him set up at a safe location and wire the speakers to the front of the bank. Yes, ma'am. Come with me. Hey. Thank you. Thank you for standing up for us. I need no one to tell me that you're new to all this and that you don't belong here. You're a gentleman, like some of the others. So, tell me, why did you choose the life of crime? Unemployment? Are you married? Do you have kids? Hey, shut up, okay? Please, please, shut up. It's okay. If you don't want to talk about it, it's okay. Look, 
I'm a petrol and product sales officer, but a lawyer by training. See, so far as no one gets killed here today, you stand a chance of not spending the rest of your life in jail. So keep your friends calm, for your sake and for all our sake. die. Don't say that. You killed the morale. No one is going to die here today. We'll all get out of this and with the money. DJ, news crew, <laughs> talk about reality TV. Turn on the television. Thanks, Stella. We are live at the Marina branch of Nexus Bank, where more than 20 civilians have been held hostage by yet-to-be-identified number of individuals said to be armed. Whether these individuals are terrorists or robbers is a clarification that even the police are unable to make at this point in time. They have threatened to kill two hostages every hour if their demand for an helicopter is not met. Why we await the response of the police? Standing with me here are two officers who called for reinforcement after noticing the rather suspicious trend of activities going on in the bank's premises. Please introduce yourself, sirs. Uh, well, <clears throat> I am Corporal C.O. Dekunli. And I am Corporal M.F. Jaga. Okay, so what initially um, attracted your attention to the bank? That made you notice the suspicious activities that prompted you to call for reinforcement. Uh, uh, well, <clears throat> um, actually, we. Uh, oh yes, ma. Ma, I have an incoming call. Oh ma, yeah ma, they are the ones. They are the ones. I need to take this immediately. Hello. I see the police is using this as a publicity window. Um, no, sir. I'm just a superintendent. The decision to meet certain demands is beyond my authority. But the area commander will be here any moment from now. Are you trying to say that you cannot give him a helicopter? Uh, all I'm saying is that the area commander will be here soon and she'll be in a better position to negotiate with you. Negotiate? You think this is Hollywood and I'm Samuel L. Jackson? I think maybe you don't understand exactly what I mean by the time the first hostage dies eight minutes from now. Please, sir. Be patient with us. We're doing all we can. Hello? Hello? Damn! Get these people away from here! Both! And expand the perimeter radius to 100 meters! Welcome, ma'am. I'm sorry, I'm late. What do we have here? About 20 hostages and an unknown number of gunmen. One way in and out of the building. Demography of hostages, aged children? No idea, ma'am. Have you established communication? Yes, we have, by telephone. Then let's build on what we have. Yes, ma'am. Hey, 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 quick pacing. You're making me nervous. You're making all of us nervous. Well, I'm nervous, because I'm only human. And human beings get nervous when things turn out in ways they didn't plan for. We should have stuck to the plan. We should have oh, stuck to the, the plan. Oh, shut the fuck up. Would you guys just screw up? I mean, we've got big issues to deal with in here. I told you we shouldn't have brought a freaking rookie along, but you wouldn't listen. We did not bring a first timer on a big house like this. Shut the fuck don't up. Don't tell me to shut the fuck up. Hey, don't you forget who's in charge here. In charge my ass. I stand here staring death in the face and you're telling me you're in charge. Well, screw you. Screw you, motherfucker. Screw you. Show me what you got. I've had enough of your bullshit, nigga. Screw me. Yeah. Screw me, one of the sins of a made up. Is it not bullshit? Get it clean for yourself. I've had enough of this bullshit, man. Is it not easy? Easy. You want to see the sins of a made up? You want it? They are not answering. Three minutes to go. Have you called for a tactical team? Yes, ma, they are on their way. Good. Can I can I get a loudspeaker? Oh, superintendent. This is superintendent Ugo. He just got back from a special train in the US. Pleased to meet you. It's a pleasure. About the loudspeaker? Oh, I'm sorry, this is all we could get in a hurry. 
that should suffice. Oh sure ma'am, I am DJ Tepeo, the number one dancer or DJ in town. Could you please turn this on? Oh. Oh. Sorry, I'm sorry. Sorry, apologies. Thank you for answering the call. To the point. Is my helicopter ready? Your helicopter will be in the air soon. What's the point of this call? Are you trying to mess with my head? You strike me as a man that means his every word. So I'm not gonna play such games with you. Good. See, if you had demanded that some money be transferred into some account of yours, it would have been done like five minutes ago. But you see, what you're asking for would take some bureaucracy to get. Are you trying to say that I cannot have my helicopter? If there were no chance of us coming to a compromise, I wouldn't even have bothered myself coming out here in the first place. Sir, please talk to me, and I assure you that the outcome is going to be mutually adequate. You see, there are certain things I need to know, like how many hostages exactly have you got in there? Or what's the use counting when one dies at the end of this minute? Listen, if things degenerate to that, I will be substituted on the grounds of incompetence. Another negotiator will be sent in to replace me, continue from where I stopped, and all this is going to do is prolong the whole process. I've already given you my word. If you give me yours in some time, I assure you, we'll be out of here in one piece. Now please tell me, how many hostages have you got in there? How many are they? Seventeen. You heard that? Yes, I heard that. I can also hear someone crying. Sounds like a child. Have you got kids in there? They all seem the same to me. Oh, come on, man. You have to let the kids go. And the aged ones, too. Hello? 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 Are you still there? Are you trying to play with my head? First you asked me how many I got in here and now you're asking me to let him go? No, 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 not at all. See, if I'm to get your helicopter to fly out of here, I have to be sure of the welfare of the people you'd leave behind. Else it still boils down to that same issue of incompetence. You seem to be getting something wrong here. That I'm the one with the guns and the hostages. Sir, a lot is at stake for me here. Of the two of us, I'm the one that's going to file in a report at the end of the day. And if I cannot show what I have done to ensure the welfare of people I negotiated for, I'm done for. You were concerned, and I assured you. Everyone saw that. What's it this time? I'm hungry. <laughs> Now listen good, the little girl only needs some food. I do too, boss. Now, is there anyone else who needs food? Well, it seems the little girl speaks for everyone in here. We need food on a large scale. Oh, that would be no problem. We can get you whatever you need. No. I'm not stupid. We'll come get the food ourselves. But what do you mean? There's an eatery opposite the bank. I'm sending one of my men to come get the food for us. Now, if he's disturbed by one of your men, you know what will happen. The choice is yours. What is in it for me on this deal if I let them through undisturbed? If he's tampered with, all these hostages in here will die of both hunger 
and punitive execution. So what you think is a consideration you're offering is something you're obliged to do. So you have to show us some goodwill. Let us believe you're the type that would give something good in return if something good is given to you. There's only a young girl and an old woman here. They both walk. Two people? What, are they too many? Oh, come on! That's all I'm offering. You know, if the police sends food to us, we can't be sure of its safety. Yeah, they could put sleeping pills or some high-tech device. Exactly! That's why we need to send one of our men to go get the food. I feel you. You know, you can put a bag over your head just to cover your face. Don't need to. Once this is over, I'm leaving Nigeria for good. Probably go see Dr. Ray and have him take my face off. I'll go get the food. All right. What you see in life on your screen is the image of one of the unidentified gunmen known to be holding not less than 20 people hostage within the banking hall of the Nexus Bank here behind me. Listen, check it. Four crooks and the rookie So when the pressure come, the fifth crumble like the cookie And undercover cops coming through trying to book me I knew there was something wrong when this man shook me huh, It don't move me, it's all about the Benjamins Getting chased down the freeway But I'm still smoking in the Benjamin Trying to get my money right So if you play with my money Then it turns to a bloody fight but All day and all night, we all right With the looks of a killer, the mob type All black with the Timberland boots 21 gun salute for the troops, we just shoot There's no limit to the steps we take We make fools out of dudes who investigate So let me set this straight We won't hesitate Till we're rich and we're walking through heaven's gate Listen Four crooks and the rookie And the rookie Double six We just sit back and check it Look, I pay the cost to be the boss I smack a nigga up and stick him up for his Porsche really? They can't do nothing uh, Just watch how we go down Lock yourselves in while we terrorize the whole town Damn. Listen, and it's all about the Naira I'm right next to banks like Tyra really? Hell no, I'm not talking about the supermodel nope. Fuck around to get your head opened up with a Google bottle huh. We the vex for the government vex. Take more, give less, no common sense oh. Coming out with the daggers and guns and the cops never wait, they stagger and run At the scene with the ammo, looking like Commando or Rambo The thing is, we don't wear camos Four crooks and the other guy And I just had to wonder why Why bring a fucking rookie to a grown man's job? Watch how we go down Sweet <laughs> Rapid response was emergency. I know the guy on TV. The robot at the bank. You mean the guy that just went for food? 
His name is Daryl Akila. We went to high school together, but he didn't graduate with us. Well, can you give me any more details like where he lives, his family, etc? Mm, not really, but you can look him up on Facebook. Also try Daryl Akila. He often drops the A in Akila. Reporting live from Lagos, Nigeria. This is CNN. Hello, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm at the office, sir. Okay, sir. I'll be on my way, sir. All right. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Going somewhere? I'm Inspector George from Lagos Police Command. I'd like to have a word with you. Mom. There are five of them, all armed. The little girl considers one of them to be very nice, but the old lady thinks otherwise. She thinks she's just afraid and believes they're not hurting anyone who gives them a better chance of getting out of this. According to the old lady, she believes members of the gang are opposed to his membership of the gang. And a disagreement just happened in the bank some minutes ago. More and more people are beginning to express their resentment over what they believe to be the lack of interest by the police to rescue the 21 civilians being held hostage at the Nexus Bank here behind me. Standing with me here is a war veteran, retired comrade YB Zamba. Over to you, sir. Yes, thank you very much. You see, this is why I don't like police. Talk it too much. Them see the criminal they are looking for. They are following him. They are following him. They are following him. Instead of them to challenge him, he come out. He take a wolf. He go. He chop. Nonsense. But they will argue it to be tactical. Which can tactics? People they suffer you, they talk of tactics. Who be tactics? That is my uh, All right, thank you, sir. I can see you're really upset over this issue. You know, we have so many unanswered questions on ground. Like, who is the insider? How they got the whole guns into the bank? If we can find out who is the insider, then this case is 50% solved. So I'm going to start with... Who is the insider? Do they have an insider? I don't know. I don't know, sir. I don't know. I don't know anything. How did he get those guns through the security door? No, sir. I don't know. I have no idea. So are you trying to say you don't know your boyfriend is an armed robber? No, I don't. I don't. He, I just saw it on television like everybody else. Hmm. Interesting. He got you this car, right? He, yes, he did. <laughs> so where do you think all this money was coming from? He kept saying he was doing deals with his friends from time to time. I didn't know the deals meant robbery. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I believe you. Like seriously, I do. I see girls like you every day. Girls who enjoy the money but never bother to question its source. <laughs> you know what? I really want to help you. The question here is, do you want me to help you? Yes, please. I will do anything. I don't want to go to jail. Very well, then. So why don't we start by you giving me the identity of his friends? They don't use their real names. They use nicknames. Hmm. So what are their nicknames? Okay, they, there's Leon, there's um, Cyborg, and the chairman, they call him Blaze. Hmm. Interesting. So there's Leon, Cyborg, and and, and the lead, leader Blaze, yeah. Yes, sir. That leaves one of them. They are five, aren't they? Okay, except it's Jazz. He's a new guy. I started hanging around with them. Very well. So where do they normally hang out? At the club on Bebo Street. Very well then. You take us there. 
Start the car. It appears as though the police intend to use force as a tactical team has just arrived at the scene and has started to deploy. Nobody knows how wise that decision might prove to be, but all we can do is wait, watch and pray for the safety of the almost 20 civilian hostages within the banking hall. Ma, Ma, why are they gearing up? Ma, if we go in hot now, surely most of the hostages are going to die. Is it not better they just killed two people in one hour? Ma, before the next 30 minutes runs out, I would have come up with a plan to divide the gang against themselves. If we can figure out a way to fill the dispute existing between the gang members, set them against themselves. It's going to make our work easier and an invasion more likely to succeed. Ma, we now know who the five gunmen are. This is the leader of the gang who we've been speaking to the whole time. His name is Gerard Osuzu, aka The one the people are accused of being soft? In that case, Ma, I think I have exactly what I need. I'm going to release the identity of four out of the five men to the press and withhold the identity of the fifth man. Hello, sir. Yes, sir. Sir, I want to find out about the Amrabah's girlfriend. Yes, sir, the, the, the young lady. Sir, uh, are we to detain her or I should let her go? Okay, sir. Yeah, yeah, I've gotten all the information that I want from her. Yes, sir. I actually dropped the information with the men on the field. Yes, sir. I'm just coming from Broad Street. Uh, actually, before I left, the area commander was planning on sending in a tactical team to set up the, the spy cameras inside the banking hall. Yes, sir. Yeah, from the information we gathered, the Amrobas, they have, uh, they have a TV screen inside the banking hall and they can see what we're doing outside from the inside. Yes, sir. So the area commander just broke out a deal with the journalists to have them turn off their cameras for the next 20 minutes to stop the live brokers, to enable our men to go in and set up the, light, uh, the spy cameras. Yes, sir. And in exchange for their cooperation, we're giving the journalists the full identity of the five gunmen which we just obtained, which they can put on air instead of a live feed. We are live in five, four, three, two, one. Action. The police now have the identity of the five men currently holding 20 people hostage in the banking hall of the Marina branch of the Nexus Bank. They are Denrele Akila, aka Killer, an unmarried 29-year-old high school dropout from Ondo State who has had several run-ins with the law. Timmy Priye Alamesia, aka Cyborg, a 30-year-old career criminal from Bayelso State and a single father of two who was just released from prison two years ago after serving a three-year jail term for unlawful possession of arms and ammunition. Lotana Unachuku Nebue, aka Leon, from Anambra State, an unmarried 29-year-old first-class graduate of microbiology from the University of Medigree, with no previous police record. David Anga, aka Jazz, from Kogi State, a 28-year-old second-class upper graduate of mechanical engineering from the University of Calabar, married with a child, the police have, however, withheld the identity of the fifth member and leader of the gang for security reasons. They say that this particular gang had been on the watch list for quite a while and that the situation on hand is a combination hey guys, of several months of a metaphor. They're only tweaking your brains. I'm not a snitch. Yeah, I guess it's just pure coincidence that the police decided to hide your identity. United we stand, divided we fall. They know that. That's why they're trying to divide us. You heard them, didn't you? I have no previous police record. How the hell do they know all about me if they were not spoon fed? I mean, Killer was outside. They must have probably seen Don't you pin this on me, boss. Don't you dare pin this one on me. Guys, you seem not to know who I am. Of course I don't know who you are. Yeah, I also don't know who your psychic is as well. It's not me. They gave my identity as well, didn't they? Hand me your gun now. I'd rather die first. Hey, chill out, guys. We've known Blaze a long time. That should count for something. He could be right. They could be trying to pitch us against each other. Bullshit, killer! Hand me your gun now! You know the saying, to catch a criminal, you send a criminal. Those guys out there, they think like criminals. 
Shut up, killer! Uh -huh. Hand me over your weapon! Well, I guess majority carries a vote now, eh? Talk to me in position, ma. Proceed with insulation. Ma, we have all the five gunmen clustered together away from the hostages. Requesting permission to engage. No, 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 do not engage. I repeat, do not engage. But ma, we may never get another opportunity better than this. I will not authorize anything without seeing things for myself. So install the damn cameras that get hell out of there. Officer, your orders are to install cams and pull back at once. Yes, ma'am. Install the damn cams. I'm sorry, guys. It has to be like this. From the beginning, would have been out of here by now. From now on, it is every man for himself. Get up! By that, what do you mean? You negotiate for you, while I'll negotiate for me. Fine! If that's what you want, fine! But nobody kills the hostages! Try and stop me. Why are you so concerned about these hostages? We all took them hostage together, so we are all accountable for them. Accountable to whom? These hostages are our bargaining power. If we kill them all, what the fuck do we begin with? That we share the hostages, so that you can have yours to pamper while I have mine to kill! Oh my god, the police look to be in total disarray at the moment. As you can see on your screen, the lead officer of the tactical team that arrived here a while ago is being taken away in a police sedan. Word reaching us have it that the area commander who is here on site moments ago ordered the immediate arrest of this officer following her refusal to follow direct orders to not engage the robbers in the gunfight. As you can see, there seems to be some resistance from the officer and all this is playing out in full glare of the public. They seem to be blaming her for the shootout that just took place inside the bank and the subsequent reaction of the gunmen in sending out one of their own to open fire at the rest of the officers outside the bank. That is not even an option. Well, it is for me. And I think you failed us as a leader. So what are you saying now? 
What I'm saying is that we divide the bargaining power four ways, and every man determines what he wants to do with his own share. Otherwise, otherwise we kill ourselves and all the hostages go home. For real. Is that what it is? That's how it is. Fine. Okay. Wise choice. Shut the fuck up! Half of you, half of you move over to his side, while half of you stay on this side. Yeah, very, very, very fucking funny. You, move here! You, you, you move here! Move it! You, get the fucking slots! Move the fuck! Move! Shut the fuck up, motherfucker! Move over here! What the fuck over here, motherfucker? What the fuck you think you are? Move, 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 move. Hello? Mr. Negotiator, put your phone on speaker. Who is this? Mr. Negotiator, I hate to repeat myself. I said put the phone on speaker now. Bring all the newsmen around you. Sir, what is this about? If you ask me one more question again, by God. Okay, okay, I will do as you say. I will do as you say. Tell the reporters that they can zoom in on the action. Toba. Toba. Are you married? Yes, sir. How old is your wife? 23. Do you have children? Yes, sir. How many? Just one. Boy. Does he look anything like you? Yes, sir. When is his birthday? He was just born yesterday. Oh, really? <laughs> so you became a, a proud father only yesterday? I know what that feels like. I'm a father myself. Please. Please. Don't kill me for the sake of my wife, please. Please. Oh, and your child too, huh? The baby. Don't worry. I'll be letting you go. Oh, ain't you gonna thank me? Thank you. Thank you so much. God bless you. It's okay. It's okay. You can go now. Go home. A man is walking out of the building right now, but what we do not know at this time is whether he too is going to be released like the other two before him, or if he will be the first person to be executed here today in line with the threats of the gunmen. <laughs> A nursing mother somewhere jubilated wildly only yesterday on the birth of her child. A boy. Today that woman kissed her husband goodbye as he went for work. Now she's a widow. And that boy, just like me, will grow up not knowing anything his father. The 
hostages remaining in here have families, responsibilities. They have dreams. Do not play with their lives. That helicopter in 15 minutes, or somebody else dies. I can't see you tonight. You know I have a husband. Where would you want me to tell him I'm going to? I can only see you during the day. Please try and understand. I know. I know. I know. But you... That doesn't mean I should shove it in his face. <sighs> okay, tomorrow, I promise. As soon as he leaves the, as soon as he leaves the house, I'll come and see you. Come on, please, I promise. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Welcome. Who was that on the phone? Nobody. Don't give me that. That was a man on the phone, right? So now you're seeing someone else? Do I have a choice? How is the baby going to feed? How am I going to feed? Is that what you have to say to me? What do you expect me to say? How can I stay faithful to a husband that cannot even feed me? Oh my but, child! But am I not doing my best? <laughs> Don't I go out every single day to look for work? You do! How could you do this to me? I... You couldn't stand by me at this time? Oh my god! <laughs> David! <laughs> I'm just tired. They're not picking up. They're trying to let us know that time for talk is over. The only thing that can get them to get out of that building is to get on the helicopter. Then why don't we actually land a helicopter nearby as bait? Then the time they used to walk from the bank to the helicopter will be a window of opportunity. Madam. Please. Madam, calm down. Please don't hurt him. Please, please. Let me talk to him. He will listen to me. Calm Let down. Let me get him to surrender. Madam, please. Madam, calm down. Which of the men is your husband? David. David. David Anger. David Anger. Yes. He will listen to me. He said, oh, they need to Nothing happen Nothing will happen. Me, it's please. okay. So please. just calm yourself down. Calm yourself I'm down. I'm calm. I'm calm. David. David Anger. Your wife is here and she would like to talk to you. You guys are the answer the phone. That's why we have to use the loudspeakers. Please pick up the phone and speak to your wife. David! David Anger! Your wife is here and she would like to talk to you. You want a refill, sir? Hello, sir. You want a refill, sir? Sir, you want another refill? Uh -uh. Sir, do you want another refill of a glass? You haven't paid me, sir. You haven't paid me, sir. Sir, sir. I be this man the crazy, ah. Which guy or which business? I be give my money before you come up for here, ah. I be pay my money, John. I be you the crazy, ah. I be which guy the guy the guy business now? Pay me my money now. Which guy want all business now? I will change for you. I will change for you now. I will change for you. I will change for you now. I be pay my money before you come out, ah. I will change for you here now. I will fight you here. I will fight you here now. Oh man, ah. Chill out. 
Ah, since my three finish, you don't want to pay me my money. I'll pay. I'll pay. Let him drink on my tap. Okay? And get him another drink so he can come drink with me. Woman problem, ain't it? <laughs> I know one when I see it. I've been there before. I know what it is like. But trust me, the very moment things start to turn around for you, and you start bringing home the big box. <laughs> That's when she'll remember to call you Sugar, Honey, Sweetheart, Sugar Lollipop, etc, etc, etc. Well, some of my friends and I run some deals occasionally, so I can hook you up. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. David! David Anger! Your wife is here and she would like to talk to you! You guys are answering the phone! Hello? 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 Yes, you're on the air. 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 Put my wife on the line. <laughs> Honey? Stop crying. It's not your fault. Everyone has problems. Handled mine wrongly. You didn't put the gun in my hand, Lavi. That was my decision. <laughs> David, it's my fault. <laughs> And I pushed you into it. I put you under too much pressure. Honey, our child can still come see you in prison. He can still be part of our lives. David, that's only if you're alive. David, but if you die today, you're gone, David. You're gone forever. David, David, I don't want, I don't want her daughter. Growing up without a father. <laughs> David, please. David, please surrender now. Don't make them hurt you. Just, just do your time and <laughs> we'll have our lives back together. Me and you. Just remember how we used to be. You kill me to sit in jail every day. <laughs> do you know what I wrote away? You're finding pleasure in another man's arms. <laughs> I swear all my life, David, I swear all my life, it's changed. David, I swear I'll change. I'll, I'll be as faithful to you. I'll be very faithful to you no matter how long it takes. David, no matter how long, just, just don't make them shoot you. David, please, David, please, David, please surrender now. David, please. Well, 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 Romeo. <laughs> it's time for business, so I need to use the phone. <coughs> Hello, Juliet. Please let me talk to him. Let, let me have the phone. Could you kindly hand over the phone to the officer beside you? Let me talk, let me talk let me, to let him. Let me have the phone. Let me talk to him. 
Hello? I'm here. What's new? <laughs> Sir, your helicopter's on its way. It's in the air already. <laughs> well, it isn't here yet, is it? It's in the air. It's on its way to you. Mr. Negotiator, the deal is that I stop killing people when I get my helicopter. I know when you claim that the helicopter is on its way. You, get up. Yeah, get up. Sir. Are you going to kill another hostage? Yep. But why? The helicopter's already on its way. Mr. Negotiator, until I get my helicopter, it's business as usual. Yeah? Come here. Freaking lover boy! The thing about killing a human being is that the more time you waste thinking about it, the more likely it gets that he'll end up killing you. You may call that killing 101. Rookie. You're going down, asshole! I die, you die. Whoa. What is it about this girl? First you escort her to take a shit. And now you make them kill your sugar daddy. All for her sake. Is she worth it? Cyborg, this is not about the girl. Cyborg, this is not no, about no, 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 the girl. No, no, Leave no, the girl no, no. out of this. You can't talk. Cyborg. You see, when you have a gun pointed at you, you don't talk. Cyborg. Talking makes you lose focus. Losing focus gets you killed. Killing one or two. Cyborg, this has nothing to do with her. Now I see what you see. Saibo, please. Oh, she's got quite a figure, huh? Man. Even with their lives in danger, they still have the presence of mind to check out a goodie kibbe. Huh? Saibo, please. Saibo. Saibo, please, please. Please. Saibo. Saibo! No. Cyborg, please! Cyborg! Cyborg, please! Please! Please, don't do it! Wait, wait! Talk to me! I do not want to kill you, but you are my helicopter. But I will kill five other hostages at once if you do not Talk let to me, me kill your Your helicopter will soon be ready! Talk to me! Your helicopter will soon be okay, there! Five other hostages Can at once! Can you hear that? Do not let me kill! Just talk to me! I don't want to kill you! Can you hear that? That's your helicopter! Can you hear that? I will kill Batman! That's your hostage. helicopter for God's sake! I'm here. Why is the pilot waiting to land the helicopter? We're trying to find a good place for it to land. A good place? No, 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 no. That helicopter lands outside this bank. That's not possible. It could hit something. A Nepal line pull anything. Well, make it happen or I'll start killing more hostages. If you kill more hostages, you don't get that helicopter. 
I'm sorry. Are you threatening me? All I'm saying is every deal comes with terms and conditions. You ask for a helicopter, we are giving it to you. All you need to do now is walk to your helicopter and you're threatening to kill more hostages. To hell with you! What did you say? I said to hell with you! Tend to land the helicopter. Once I get off the phone, I can sort that out. Well, sort it out and get back to me fast. Okay, set me down at the car parking marina, okay? Okay, children. Game over. All right, he's here. Leave this fool and let's go. No one is leaving me behind. We came together. We lived together. We eventually got that right by killing hostages. Now you want in? We all escape, or we all get caught. I come with you, or nobody leaves. Alright, what the hell? Let's all go. <laughs> you one sick motherfucker! Loon! 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 <coughs> I'm okay. <coughs> he also shoots like a girl. <laughs> I would love to kill you, but I won't. I want you to leave to go to jail for the rest of your miserable life. See how it feels to sit in a lonely, dark room 24-7 forever. That will make me happier. The manager is up. Where is he? In the vault. Okay. We'll clean him up and bring him back out. We'll be needing him. Hurry up! <laughs> I gotta stop playing games and hurry up! <laughs> that's it! That's it! That's it! You, 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 you. I need your clothes. Take them off. Your helicopter is down. I know, I know. I can see it. I also know that you're eager to have us come out so you can have your sharpshooters cross the building and take us out. Oh, but don't worry, we are coming out. So there is something I'd want to talk to you about. Well, you like my swag? <laughs> see, the helicopter carries only six people and the pilot already has a seat. Well, you won't have to worry about that anymore because some of us are no longer ambulatory. Mr. Negotiator? Sir? What's your name? Ugo. Superintendent Ike Ugo. Okay, Superintendent Ugo. It's been nice dealing with you. So I'd like to leave you with a little parting gift. Something to make you look good in front of your superiors. Sir, what are you talking about? Five hostages for two bulletproof vests. Now I know you don't trust me, so as a sign of goodwill, I'm letting the hostages go first. Now, five of you without shirts, thank you for your donations. You may go now. Go before I change my mind! They're down to just two men. 
So you asked for two first, not three. Order all civilians away from the vicinity. I repeat, order all civilians away from the vicinity. D1, D2, on my command! The police have forced everyone away from the area, including the press, and they're advising civilians to seek cover. We do not have a vantage point at the moment, but my cameraman is trying to situate our camera right opposite the bank. We hear that any moment from now, we will be seeing the gunmen and all the hostages in the bank step outside those doors. We do not know why the just released hostages had their shirts taken from them, but oh wait a minute, I think we do. to see just two gunmen step outside those doors but now five potential targets all wearing masks have just emerged and are mingling with the hostages and suddenly it has become impossible to tell who the actual gunmen really are ah come on shoot all five shoot them in the arms and legs the one that stayed down at the innocent the one that stand up and run and the ones we're looking for that's simple ah d1 d2 now ah! oh my god they're gonna shoot the hostages Now, what do you have to say about the outcome of events here today? Ah! <laughs> I'm sorry for all the things I don't talk before. Nigeria police, now super! Ha <laughs> ha! Them try, them try, them try, them try, them try, them try. <laughs> How would you describe the role of the media and the success of that operation? Simply put, priceless. As you know, our primary strategy on that day was successful due to the cooperation of you and your colleagues. We look to see more of such exemplary cooperation between the media and the police force in the future. And for the roles you all played in saving the lives of those hostages, you all got promoted. In some cases, two steps up. Like you moved from area commander to deputy commissioner of police. And each of you got moved from the rank of superintendent to chief superintendent.
take a step back. Sure. Come back. See, see where you have to stand. Yes. Come back one more step. One more step for you. Mark that position. That's where you stop. Salut, tu vas